Hi everyone, it's Kirchi. For this Polly Pocket showcase, I'm gonna bring it back to the modern Polly Pockets again and show the Sweets Compacts. Here they are, they're so cute. You can already recognize the donut because it's one of the more popular ones. We also have this cupcake and the slice of cake. So let's take a look. We're gonna start with this beautiful sparkly donut. This is called Donut Pajama Party. This one is already pretty well known. I see this a lot on social media. It's really pretty. I love the icing. It has glitter. I love glitter. The sprinkles are gold. Very nice. I like how it looks like a galaxy. That may or may not have been what they were going for, but I like it. This one is from 2018. The bottom is smooth, but donuts are smooth on the bottom, so this works. I love the little details here, how they made the feet heart-shaped. Now let's take a look. Very simple inside, not a whole lot going on, but let's go through it all. This is a slumber party themed compact. Down here is the living room. They've got this big purple couch and it opens up. It turns into two little beds, kind of like a bunk bed situation. I wish the pillows and blankets were all 3D. For some reason, only this pillow is 3D, but the rest of it are stickers. Then on this side, they have a big TV with a stereo system. They also have a gaming console here, which looks like a Game Boy, and a controller. Up here, they've got a book. They have tea somehow sitting near electronics, which is very unsafe. There's a karaoke system with a heart and a microphone. The remote is actually a button, and when we press it, it flips through two different channels. On this side, we have some sort of singing game or dance game, and on the other side, I believe that's the Polly Pocket TV show. They're actually space rangers, I think. They have ray guns, and they're in spacesuits. Then we have what appears to be an activity wheel. So they spin this wheel and it lands on these four activities. And it looks like they match up to the activities we've seen so far. We have the space TV show. We have the heart, which matches this heart. So I guess that's karaoke. Then we have music, which is the music TV show. And baseball, which probably matches one of these activities up here. There you go, you can go outside and play sports, I guess. Or maybe they mean absolutely nothing. Down here on the ground, it looks like they have made a mess. There's popcorn here, another controller, there's pizza on the floor, just a bunch of random stuff laying around. They really need to clean up. Just because you're having a slumber party doesn't mean you have to be a slob. This is what happens when you're a slob. A mouse shows up at your house and eats your food. Look at that cute little mouse door. I grew up watching Tom and Jerry and I was under the impression that every house had one of these holes where mice just kind of lived. Up here looks to be the rest of the house. We already saw this door where you can exit the house. Just some stuff up here. We have trophies. We have a cap, it looks like. A backpack. Just some random stuff. By the stairs, we have pictures of Polly and her parents. I'm not sure if that's baby Polly, but she is so cute. Going up the stairs, we get to the kitchen because the kitchen is on the highest level. We have these two pink and purple chairs and they rotate. Standard kitchen stuff, we have a counter with some plates, a stove, pots and pans, a sink, and some cupboards. And in the fridge, she's actually got a bunch of food. She has a whole cake in there. There's also some food on the side here that so badly wants to be repainted. Here is Polly. She's wearing an all pink outfit and her shirt has a panda. She is joined by her friend Shawnee. She's got a cute little bow in her hair. We have this motorcycle which looks like a pizza delivery vehicle. We can see the pizza box right here. And inside is the pizza. It looks like it's just made of cheese, which is the exact opposite of the type of pizza I order. And here is our poly stick with a bunch of popcorn. Next, we have birthday cake bash. It's a slice of cake. It looks so cute and delicious. I love how realistic the frosting looks. The icing is hot pink, and we have regular sprinkles and heart sprinkles. There's also this cake texture on the side. You can see it ever so slightly. And this one is also from 2018. 
Right away we can tell that this is a birthday party. We see some presents down here and this super big one. This one opens up into a compartment. We have a carousel with two orange horses. The horses actually look very cute. They have a lot of detail and texture. I just wish that they were painted. There's really good texture on the bottom here too. There's a long table here with photography props. We have some mustaches, masks, and party hats. And when we open this, we get a buffet that looks so delicious. We've got pizza, donuts, and cake. On the floor here, we have a bunch of confetti. I love the little stars on these stairs. On the second level is a dance floor. There's a DJ booth here with a big stereo system. This platform turns, so it looks like the dolls are dancing. There's a lounge area here where you can just sit and relax if you're tired of partying. I think these are also stairs, but there's not enough space to stand. You turn the disco ball and you can see the pinata before the candy comes out and after. There's also more presents up here and some decoration in the background. Also, some of these areas look like poly sticks, like this one here, but the dolls actually don't stick, so I'm gonna use one of the poly sticks and just stick it here. Here is Polly. She's wearing a pink frilly skirt and she's got confetti on her shirt. And this is Lila. I guess she's the birthday girl because she has a birthday cake on her shirt. Why didn't you invite Shawnee and your other friends to your party, Lila? Here's the top of the present that we saw earlier. Underneath is a little heart shape and you can attach this ring that it comes with right on the present. Here's what it looks like. Of course, it doesn't fit me. We also get this giant birthday cake. It looks really cute and full of icing. I hope they're not using fondant here. And it opens up and we can put the dolls in there. This also has a heart on the bottom so you can wear it as a ring. She's coming out of the cake. How cute. And here is our poly stick filled with cupcakes. Our third food compact is Sweet Treat Cupcake. This is another super familiar looking one. It's a giant cupcake with purple icing and gold sprinkles, which goes nicely with the Polly Pocket logo. The bottom is yellow and I love the cupcake texture here. On the back, the same texture is repeated. So it's nice that we get to see that on the back too. And this is the oldest one of the sets that I showed you. This is from 2017. This looks like a combination between the donut and the cake. We're in a house, so it looks like it's a slumber party, but we have a bunch of desserts, so it looks like we're having some sort of dessert party. Down here is what appears to be a dance game, kind of like Dance Dance Revolution. This platform just rocks back and forth like this. It gives the illusion that they're dancing or playing the game. It bothers me that the sticker isn't perfectly aligned on there. On the other side, we have a retro arcade game that actually looks really cute. I just wish that it was interactive. Then we have this giant table full of desserts. And when we lift the table, it turns into a dance floor. On the second level, we have another kitchen. Again, standard kitchen stuff. We've got a stove, a sink, and inside the oven, it looks like we're baking cookies. There's also some pies in there. I'm not much of a baker, but I'm pretty sure you should bake them separately. Maybe not. I just eat them. We also have some fast food items in the background. We have a milkshake, burger, and curly fries. I actually can't eat these anymore because for the past three weeks, I have been having some digestive issues. My reason to live taken away from me. There's a fridge over here and inside. We have some health foods. We have fruits and veggies, but of course you have to have your carbs. There's some cake and bread. We have two flights of stairs over here. That little gumball has a face. That's so cute. Again, the misalignment of these stickers. Ah, there's a cash register here. So I just realized that this whole thing is some kind of shop. Feels a little Shopkins to me. There's also some cute cupcake textures all around here. What's behind this door? A gigantic dog. Why? Not that I'm complaining. I think she's cute, but do we have some sort of Clifford situation here? Why is she a giant? What is she doing at the door? Does she want some cupcakes? Either way, she's cute. Here is Polly. She looks like the shopkeeper, or dare I say, shoppy. 
She's got her apron with some cupcake pins. Here is Shawnee. I'm guessing she's the other shopkeeper because she's also got an apron. They have a purple motorcycle with a big pink cupcake on the back. And we have what appears to be some kind of karaoke system. There's a microphone, music notes on the side, and a screen on the front, so it is probably a karaoke system. And of course, we have our poly stick, which looks exactly like the cake one. Yes, they are identical. The cake one should have probably had actual cake on it, not just cupcakes. Knowing that they already have a cupcake theme, someone was cutting corners here. Those were super, super cute, and like I said before when I showcased the animal set, I just love how creative these compacts are. They may not have as much detail as the vintage ones, but the exterior is really, really cute, and that's one reason why I keep buying them. Thank you for watching this Polly Pocket Showcase, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.